when you was 11, 12, 13 years old and you first stumbled across these adult movies, these X-rated videos, you ain't know you was going to become a serial meat beater. You just thought you was just living in the moment. You didn't really think things through to the end. You had no intentions of becoming this type of person. You had no intentions of becoming a serial meat beater. The same way with an alcoholic. That's not their intentions. Their intentions is to escape the moment and feel good. But eventually they become an alcoholic. Because they stay on a drink. Same thing with a chain smoker. Same thing with a pothead. Same thing with all addictions. We don't start out with these intentions because we don't really think things through. So how do we think things through? As we got to start asking ourselves, what am I becoming? Before each decision. Before each, de before each decision that you make throughout the day, throughout your life. What are you becoming? Who will you be if you keep partaking in this activity? Who will you be if you take that new job? Who will you be if you stay the same? Who are you becoming if you just stay inside your house all day, cry, bitch, and moan about women ain't shit, it's a lonely world, bitter? Who are you becoming? Just think about that. Visualize it. Is that who you want to be? Start to think these things through. Just don't act randomly and do random habits, random actions, make random decisions for no reason without thinking these things through. Who are you becoming? Who are you becoming every day when you wake up and you hit snooze 50 times? Who are you becoming when you wake up and you hit straight for the weed? And you just smoke all day. Right before you go to sleep. Still smoking. Who are you becoming? When you open that X-rated video. And you get out the lotion. You're becoming more of the person you don't want to be, right? So you got to start asking yourself. Who do I want to be? What decisions would a person that I want to be make? Who am I becoming if I go for a walk instead? Who am I becoming if I get straight out of bed, start exercising, start meditating, start doing something other than what I usually do? Something more constructive, something that's going to better my life and enhance my life. So the question comes again. Who are you becoming, bro? Who are you becoming? If you just watch this video and you take no action and you don't do anything constructive behind it, you just watch it for mental masturbation, like a lot of these videos on this platform, like the semen retention and the no fat. You watch a thousand videos on it. Why do you need a thousand videos on this shit? It's mental masturbation. Who are you becoming? Who are you becoming? By not doing the things that you told yourself you was going to do. There's less than three months left in 2024. And I know at the start of this year you had in mind a certain person you wanted to become. Certain goals you wanted to accomplish. Have you moved towards those? Have you done anything to become that person? How many of your goals have come to fruition? Are you still the same person you were at the start of the year? And it might be because you didn't ask yourself, who am I becoming? So start to view your life that way because these small decisions really do add up and they compound. Your decision to say no to drinking alcohol every day 
is going to compound. And you won't be an alcoholic because of it. Your decision to say no to the adult movies leads you to become somebody who's not a serial meat beater. So start to think these things through. These benign, these small decisions really do add up and they determine your destiny. They determine your character, your habits. What are you, what are you doing every day? What are you doing this very moment, this very day to become better? What do you desire to do? Not what you wish to do. What do you desire to do? Because a lot of people can wish. A lot of people can say, yo, I want to be in shape. I want to have that beautiful girl. I want to have the most money. I want to be this, that, and the other. And you can wish all day. A lot of people wish. But how many people get it? Because they don't really desire it. They don't really put any type of action towards anything. They don't even put one step towards doing what they say they want to do. You know how many people I uh, talk to in my life that say, yo, I want to lose weight. I want to get in shape. And then you will talk to them months down the line and they ain't took one step outside the house. Literally. They're just chilling in the house all day. Soaking in their own filth. Soaking in their own sorrow and their own apathy and laziness. So stop just wishing upon a star. Stop just wishing that you had a girlfriend. Stop just wishing that you had a beautiful woman in your life and go out and actually take a step towards getting one. And that might be just working on yourself for now. That might just be working on your masculinity and working on your energy and your confidence and your swag. How you carry yourself. That really means a lot more than just the way you look. It's the energy behind what you're doing. And when I say desire, I don't mean you sit here and crave it all day to where you can't enjoy the present moment. To where you don't want to do nothing. Because you don't have what you think you should have. You don't have what you think you deserve. You ain't putting no work towards doing it. You got to take the steps first to really have it. So don't crave something or anything in this world, bro. Because it's already really yours. If you desire it, you can have it. But that desire that you have is just a wish if you don't take any steps towards it. Every day, every moment, every small decision that you make from now on, just have that in the back of your mind. Who am I becoming by doing this? Who am I becoming by saying no? To all the bullshit and working on myself. Who am I becoming? By embracing the solitude. And embracing this season of life. And just going ghost from everybody and leveling up. Who am I becoming? Who is going to be the person 90 days from now? A half a year from now? Or are you just worried about feeling good in a moment? Having pleasure in a moment? And then you're just becoming somebody who's fueled by pleasure. Somebody who's fueled by the fear of missing out. You just want to feel good in the present moment. You just want to feel good right now. As a man, you can't do that. But it's all up to you, bro. It's your life. Think for yourself. You just all my thoughts. It's some words of inspiration for you. Is in hustler, no slave. I love y'all. I'm out this bitch. <laughs>